It's little old me, Mistress Azrael. Now, I'm sorry for the scary no makeup thing, but I just woke up from a wonderful dream. It's first thing in the morning and got a knock at my door and my box of dread has arrived. So screw the makeup. We're just going to dig on into this sucker. It's my very first unboxing video. So I'm going to do a couple of things. I'm going to do the unboxing from my box of dread and then I'm going to walk you through some wonderful collectibles that I just recently got. And this is going to be the intro to a whole new version of my Mistress Azrael channel. So... After this, I'll interlay some photographs where you can actually see me where I'm a little less nightmarish frightening, but whatever. It's Freddy Krueger. If he can have burnt face, I can have no face. So, here we are. This is the August Box of Dread from boxofdread.com. I'll put a link in the description box below. Um, this month's theme is Nightmare on Elm Street, my absolute favorite. There's two things on Earth that I absolutely love and covet and collect, and that's Nightmare on Elm Street and Elvira. So, a little later I'll do some videos highlighting my Elvira collection, because we're just now starting to get into that season, Not Scary Farm starts next month, and then, of course, her brand new show, Elvira's Asylum, is going to be premiering, so we have lots of costumes and kamikaze and things coming up, so bear with me. So, number one, Box of Dread. I'm going to... It's only appropriate I use this to get into it, so... Dun, 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 dun. Slicey, slicey, slicey. So excited I could spit. All right, let's see what we got. Hmm. So here we go, a box of dread and all their links that you can follow them on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I put all these in the description below. This is my very first box of dread, so I'm not sure what to expect, but from all the unboxing videos that I've seen and on the recommendation of my dear friend, Horror Gal, who I will talk about in a little bit, um, I decided to go ahead and do this one because it's Nightmare on Elm Street and you can never go wrong with me on that. Unless if it's a bunch of the remake stuff and then I'll be really, really mad. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's, everything's all folded up in here, all nice and neat and pretty. So I'm just going to kind of slide it out of here. And get the cardboard box out of the way. Dump, 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 dump. Ooh! Okay, first we have a Sinister Be Careful Children at Play. Bracelet, I forgot, this is a mashup. The original theme was Nightmare on Elm Street, but they also tossed in um, promotional items for Sinister 2, which I believe is coming to the theaters this week or very soon. So that's a Sinister jelly bracelet, that's neat. Ah, here we go, horror series, a Nightmare on Elm Street Freddy Krueger reaction figure. These are awesome, and I've been wanting to get these, and every time I run to like a Barnes & Noble or a Toys R Us, they're always gone. So, yay, Nightmare on Elm Street reaction figure. Freddy Krueger. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, there's that. And then, okay, two disc collectors edition, Never Sleep Again. This seems to be the Blu-ray sleeve, and it's been autographed. And I can't tell by whom. I'm assuming it's by one of the two amazing men that put Never Sleep Again together. I have the DVD. And I was actually at the release at Dark Delicacies, so I have my DVD and I have the Never Sleep Again poster that's signed by everyone, which I will show you in a minute because that's another part of my collection I wanted to highlight. So I'm going to have to go through and recognize who this autograph is, but this is pretty cool. It's just the sleeve by itself, but it's still an autograph piece of memorabilia. Um, I'm really, really bad with names, and I have a couple of friends like Deandrea who's probably going to slap me the moment she watches this going, uh, dude, you should really remember shit. But again, it's first thing in the morning, I'm tired, and it's my day off, so bear with me. So that's awesome. That's frameable. That's really cool. Okay, Nightmare on Elm Street window hanger. This is ironic and funny for me because I was just at the Halloween Clubs, which is an amazing place that I highly recommend you visit. Uh, my friend Horror Gal, if you've seen any of her videos, she's done a walkthrough, and she actually just bought this, so sorry, honey, you're going to be a little upset, but now you have two, so yay, there's a lot of windows in your house. Um, I almost bought this because I just did a screening of Nightmare on Elm Street 3 at the Frida Cinema in Santa Ana, California with special guest Ken Sagos, which is this bag of stuff that I'll get into in a minute. And I almost bought this to decorate the theater. Instead, I went with the one that's red with the stripes and just his silhouette. So, yay, now I have two. And this one's still in its package. 
Awesome. All right, here's a sinister poster. Be careful, children at play, August 21st. So yes, it opens tomorrow. Today is August 20th, so that's very cool, frameable. I haven't seen the movie, but I am planning on seeing it possibly this weekend. And this is interesting. There appears to be adhesive on the side, so I'm guessing you stick this in a mirror and it's a hologram. So I don't know if you can see it, I can. Um, if you tilt it one way, it's gone. If you tilt it back, it's there. So if you stick this, I'm assuming, to like a mirror or something, it's just to mess with your face. And again, I'm not very familiar with Sinister. It's from the producers of The Purge, Paranormal Activity, and Insidious. I've seen the commercials. I understand so the good. idea. It's well worth the subscription. The subscriptions are $14 uh, a month and $6 in shipping. So a, a flat total of $20. And you get a box of amazing horror items once a month. So that's very, very cool. Got to, again, window decoration, an autographed Blu-ray sleeve of Never Sleep Again, which I'm sorry, boys, I love your documentary, and I'm really mad at myself that I can't remember your name right now. It will come to me. I'll figure it out. Sorry. I'll put it in the description with apologies. And then this is the thing I'm most excited about, my reaction figure. That's awesome. So a pretty good haul for 20 bucks. Awesome. I'm here.